This is episode three of our five-part series, a journey beyond the familiar boundaries of space and time. We often talk about black holes, about how they look from the outside, but how do they appear from within? When a massive star collapses into a black hole, it doesn't suddenly change at the moment it crosses the Schwarzschild radius and forms a black hole. The star's matter continues falling inward, but something extraordinary happens. An invisible boundary forms, the event horizon. From inside, how would we notice crossing the horizon? We wouldn't. Locally, everything would feel the same. But the horizon locks information. It creates a point of no return, not because of a wall, but because space and time themselves tilt beyond recovery. Now imagine, what if everything we observe, our entire visible universe, is inside such a horizon? What would we see if we looked toward the edge? We would see galaxies closer to the horizon, their light stretched by time itself, shifted to longer wavelengths, to redder colors. To us, this stretching would look like acceleration, as if galaxies were fleeing faster and faster into the distance. In another video in this channel, we proposed a bold idea that our universe might resemble the interior of a black hole. And remarkably, the size of the visible universe is close to the Schwarzschild radius calculated from its mass. So what would it truly mean if we are living inside a black hole? In the next episode, we will turn to one of the greatest discoveries of the last century, a discovery that won the Nobel Prize, the Cosmic Microwave Background.